Um, intrigued. I mean, I have strange experiences from art because I've seen art through Quiva's world, but never really through my own decision to go myself. It's the first time that I've actually decided to go to something, so it's different, yeah. I'm getting a bit more meaning, I think, from stuff. That's it. I think it's really nice place to start with. It was really cozy. I really like the opening talks. And uh, so far it's really nice uh, impression. I wish we could have had this uh, place when we were graduating from fourth year, yeah. I will open all day and then it's different working. Awesome. I saw a beautiful painting of himself. I saw downstairs. <laughs> and here it was film and I, I haven't seen yet behind me, but there's something uh, <laughs> fluid on the ground. So I think it's, uh, yeah. Not everything I like, it's so special. Well, there are uh, going high, something like this. Different works. Kudos to the PR Own works. I did my job for sure. All right. Thanks. Thank you. Oh, he can, uh, he can answer yeah. too. <laughs> I'll wait to say anything about it. I prefer to wait. It's really nice to see. It's like very bizarre. So you see like a lot of different stuff and I really like it. There's like a little bit of everything. Yeah. Thank you. I really like the, the video there that Marnix made. It was really cool to see. With the different voices and the different pop-ups. I thought it was really creative. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm really impressed with like most that I'm seeing. Like not every everything, of course, like uh, speaks to me as much as uh, different works. But uh, yeah, I've seen a lot of things that I'm really uh, that kind of hits the spot of like interest and beauty as well. So convincing uh, exposition so far. Uh, I think every piece of artwork evokes a different kind of emotion. So. I can't actually think of one word to describe my whole experience over here. But everything has a different emotion, so that's what I would say. <laughs> I like it. I do. I like it every time. Every time I come to an art gallery like this, I, there's always something I like, there's always something I don't like, or just mainly feel confused about it. Uh, I think the most important thing is when I come to these things is that the artists are actually there at their own yeah, their own stations or what they are uh, how do you call that exhibiting yeah so because sometimes you know if I see portraits like this and there's text with it uh, sometimes you have a, just a little card with it that says you know what kind of the idea what they're trying to do and I think okay nice and then I can let my own fan fantasy goes but when you get these especially with technology I need somebody there. Spe yeah, I know. I think it's it, the 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 things I really like about this art expo lately, because a couple of years ago we had the, you see a, a certain trend of technology moving in into art. I think I need a bit more explanation with what I'm seeing because it's it's so vast. You know, if I see a portrait or a painting or uh, a living room or a lot of instruments on the floor with a painter while there's music playing, you know, I can there's there's something to watch, but I can grasp the idea. But when it's moved in with technology, it's difficult. I noticed, I noticed that today that uh, I went into a couple of rooms and I thought, and I see these screens and I see a lot of happening on the screens and it looks, some of them looks really amazing, some of them looks really weird. But most of the time I think, I just don't know what the artist is trying to explain with this. So it's kind of frustrating and then I think, okay, I'll, I'll just move on. You know, if there's not somebody there around to explain it to me, then yeah, I'm kind of caught in a bind or something. So I'll just move on to something I kind of can explain. Yeah. So I guess that's my idea of this expo. I like it very much, but I need some explanation a lot of times, though. <laughs> it's confused. Confusing. It's confusing. It's confusing and, uh, very, very different impressions. It's, it's new. New and lovely. I like it. Yes. <laughs> wow, so many things. <laughs> oh, I love it too. Thank you so yes. much. It's good to see in, in what uh, world my, my son lives here. Yeah, yeah it's I, I'm, I'm, so much, so much different impressions. Yes. What it, um, it shows, uh, I can't imagine how it is in your minds, what you think 
think about something and then it becomes something. But uh, most of it I don't understand. But perhaps it's art you don't have to understand. We just we, love we, it. We normally live in a, another world and we come here and so many strange things. I feel myself for the first hour disoriented. Uh, yes, not in, uh, in our world. It's another world. It's the world in your mind and not in our minds. Yes. I'm curious. Very curious. Yeah, curious. For now. Yeah. Really? A lot of different things which I like. Right. But yeah, we saw so things. So, yeah. Curious, right? I really like the drawings. Yeah, uh, sort of fetish uh, pregnant women. Uh, very nice uh, pencil lines. It's pretty much what I've seen. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how I feel. So that's, uh, I'm sorry I'm going to give such a boring response. I don't know how I feel because you have to take so much in at once because everyone is here and there are also so many people here. So it's not like I can fully um, I don't, yeah, take it in, absorb each artwork, which is a bit of a shame. But it's also nice that everyone's here at the same place. So, yeah, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. Uh, but the, the atmosphere is really nice because everyone's, everyone's happy, everyone's happy to see me, I'm happy to see everyone. And I, I would say I would interpret the whole space as an artwork and that makes me feel good. So I'd, I'd say that I feel good. It's not an everyday thing for me, so yeah. I've been to such places and I really enjoy the environment and the people. But uh, yeah, when I see this or when I see that or when I see that, like, okay, wait, I need to take my time. It's not something easy for me to. Some things are easier, some things are not. Well, um, how do I feel? I guess overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. I don't feel like I can invest the time and effort into any given work that is needed to get a full, the full, you know, depth of it, so to say. Well, that's how I feel about it. I do have to say that I feel very amazed by all the creativity that people can create. Like all the things that they can, they can see and then also put into their little world that they can move around and make objects out of it. As if like you're just taking things out of your mind and making them into real objects. So I would say I'm very amazed. Um, I feel hope and I also feel uh, comfortable. And, uh, I feel uh, free to explore everything and uh, take what I will for my own out of it. And, but I also like that uh, it's everything in this place and it's two floors full of art. And, yeah. And yeah, I love it. Yeah. Uh, I'm feeling that uh, I'm, I don't know who am I, uh, or actually I'm, I'm feeling that uh, by uh, being aware, aware of here and now, and by being aware here and now in this space where there is a, like a creative, expressive um, ways. Uh, happening. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling very, very connected to everything. <laughs> so the I feel connected. <laughs> That's it. <laughs>